We are witnessing the achievements of mankind in the field of renewable energy and advanced technologies intended for the development of a green economy. Expo Day 67. The rich culture of the Turkish people is represented at the Expo in the framework of the National Day of the Country. The parade of the military orchestra Mehter took place in the exhibition. Its music symbolizes power. Since the time of the Ottoman Empire, it was responsible for the banner. They entertained the audience and craftsmen of different crafts. Great interest was caused by the girl blowing out glass souvenirs. She makes talismans with an eye. The eyes cast on the glass symbolize the soul, mind, and heart. Another master acquainted guests with the art of drawing on the water, Ebro. According to some gifts, this art originated in Turkey. Observing the mixture of colors, it is difficult to imagine, and in the end there will be clear outlines of objects. The guests and the calligrapher, who is well acquainted with ancient Ottoman writing, were also astonished. <laughs> This is a kind of Arabic script. Basically, for the memory, I write surahs from Quran or Hadith, sometimes poetry. Most often, of course, people ask to write their names. I learned Ottoman writing in three, four months. After all, this is the alphabet that people of Turkey used almost 90 years ago. Aydin Kose has been engaged in calligraphy for 20 years. He took a great interest in this art while still being a student, but it took him more than six years to master it. His brushes are made of bamboo, and so that the paint does not spill, he puts a piece of silk thread there. Aydin has already presented his work in 50 countries. By the way, he visited the expo in Shanghai and probably will amaze the audience of the exhibition in Dubai, which will be held there in three years. The cradle of ancient civilizations, Mexico, today boldly holds a course towards the energy of the future. The 13th country in the world located in North America, the state is washed by the Pacific Ocean and the Gulf of California in the west, and in the east by the waters of the Gulf of Mexico and the Caribbean. Thanks to rich water resources, the share of hydropower is more prevalent in energy production than solar and wind power sources. And in the capital Mexico City, with a population of more than 20 million people, projects on the transition to the stability of Mega City are successfully implemented. We are here at the Expo 2017 Astana. We are so happy to be here because we would like to present what is Mexico, what offers Mexico to the world. The works of the world-famous artist Frida Kahlo will acquaint the guests with the special atmosphere of Mexico. In the pavilion of the country, you can also learn about natural resources, beautiful places for rest and study of monuments of ancient civilizations. Mexico cannot be imagined without a sombrero and cacti. Only in the lower California peninsula there are 110 species of cacti, 80 of which do not grow anywhere else in the world. It turns out that some thorny plants are very sweet in taste. High technologies such as data centers around the world give off huge amounts of heat. Today, scientists find applications of such surplus heat in the heating of farms and residential complexes. Kazakhstani scientist Zaltai Alimgazin developed its system of green heating for entire residential quarters. Heat pumps operate on the principle of refrigerators, thus from 1 kilowatt of electric energy expanded, it can be obtained from 3 to 7 kilowatts of heat. Water for technical needs, in the same way, warms up to 70 degrees. Domestic heat pump technology is able to work even in conditions of severe climate, without harm to nature. The installation pays off in a period of 3 to 12 months, and the author of the development is sure that it can last up to 50 years. When large IT data centers are heated, this energy is not used and leaves nowhere. Altai Alimgazin came up with a device that can remove this energy and transmit it to residential complexes. The greenhouse heat pumps are used, they heat water and transfer it to residential complexes.